What's up guys, Mitch here from Superior Engineering. We are out at the Brisbane stop of the National 4x4 and Camping Show. We're here to hang out with a whole bunch of our friends, check out some of our absolutely killer vendors. So let's go on and take a walk on through. Been a little too nice to y'all. Now I got a price for y'all. Snake eyes on dice for y'all. Shoulders on ice for y'all. A6 all the hay. I won't get involved today. Got lost in the ball and days. I'm flipping the bars. I'm flipping the flipping the flipping the all record off record. I still count wins when they got it. All record off record. I let them take advantage. I was wildin'. All record off record deals. Tell them talk to Colin for the quote. All record off record. I still want to act, not the ghost. For the record, I'm done trying to make y'all comfortable. For the record, you ain't trying to grow any stuff for you. For the record, lab on me going all the way. For the record. What's going on, guys? We're at the Prison Four Drive Show here with the man, the Ashen. Here, here with the girls from Red Dirt Diary and man Sam Isles himself. Now I've got a couple of questions for Sam to see what's been happening with him. So mate, one question is, yeah. who would you, out of your group of friends, never let drive your car? Oh my god. Sam Isles. Yeah. To be honest, I haven't had a bad experience. Everyone that's driven has taken really good care of it, and I want everyone to enjoy the fun bus. So, as long as you're responsible, yeah, so anyone can drive I it. I feel like there's one we we'll agree on that we wouldn't let drive our car would be Sam Isles. Yeah, I take that back. Yeah. I take that back. That guy has a way with machinery. Not my car. Stay away. <laughs> yeah. It's between Macca and, and TJ. TJ's cautious, but he's like a bit scary to drive with. Maka, I feel like he's got a bit of forward driving experience, but it gives him confidence. But looking at the state of his car, I'd probably say Maka because fair. he's scratched his head out of it. If you could own any other influencer's car, who would it be? I was gonna say Matty Oh, I hope you guys know who I'm gonna say. Shory. Yes. Yeah, his, his stout is, yeah, you know it. Yeah. His stout is like, Brie, back me. It's just, I've, I've said it's this from unique. day one. It's it unique, it's cool. Drive. And a lot of my car build was actually inspired off his car. The attention to detail, it's just a cool car. Yeah. Google it, it's great. <laughs> Um, for me, I'm honestly thinking I'd love my car, so it's really hard for me to want another car because it's set up for exactly what I want to do. But if I was to choose one, I'm choosing it because it's just dumb and stupid and kind of impractical, but it's just a whole lot of fun. It would be Sam's 80. Yeah, definitely. Oh, that's a good answer. Power. That's yeah, all power. about the petrol yeah. turbo. Ooh, I'm going to have to say the Twins FJ. Mm. I've, I've seen that car up close and it's just the engineering on it. Something special, something different. I'd probably take that. Yeah. It does my dad and count because yeah, I'd take hey. that. Jeep. You take Jeep? All these tax. Yeah, probably these t t tax. Oh, if yeah, I could yeah. own anything else. Yeah, you definitely go with that. What's your favourite superior mod? It's something coming that I haven't used yet. It's very exciting, which is your like, electronic shock absorbers, yes. which I'm really keen to get my hands on, so I think that's going to be a game changer. Um, but right now, I think it's it's having that adjustment on your um, on your shocks, on your, yeah. on your rebound and all that. But yeah, having the electronic one just makes that so much easier. Yeah, but I do 100%. notice a difference. The first shock of is we actually notice a difference turning yeah. that knob. So. Yeah. I'd say um, with the long arms in the rear, I guess rid of that I rear and steer I, that I patrols. I just have, but obviously everything's awesome. Uh, well, I've pretty much got the entire catalogue, so it's really hard to choose just one, but one we recently did do, which was the long arms. Uh, it's improved on-road driving and off-road driving, and I just, I can't complain. It's making the car 100 times better. 100%, I recommend it every patrol owner. Yeah. You guys did it, but it's technically not yours, but the safety that I now feel after you guys took care of my braking system. Yep. Can I say that? 100%. Oh, okay. I, we say. I, being a tourer I, and being a heavy car, not having that much experience with heavy cars, I want to feel safe. Definitely. Um, and, I, and I can't explain to you 
I feel silly waiting so long to get that done. Yeah, yeah. definitely. Having control in all aspects makes driving way more yeah, comfortable. Yeah, 100%. Yeah, yeah. 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 What's the hardest track you've driven? There's two. One was a while ago. It was actually in a different car. It's the Starkey track. It's about an 11-hour slow rock crawly thing up through the Cape from Cape Melville down to Elon, uh, Elon Beach. Yep. The other one, me, uh, Matt Baker, we went from Cape out to Fink. We thought we'd take a shortcut. It came up to the, I think it's the Mitchell River. It was about yep. 150 metres of water crossing with a causeway that was washed out it wasn't hard but it was sketchy so yeah. it's, it's between those two i think mine's obvious um when i drove gunshot in the budget build yeah. the car made it hard the track made it hard my experience made it hard i felt all the feelings but it was probably the most rewarding thing i've put myself through for 2022 it was the hardest but the best if that yeah. kind of makes sense definitely. i feel like only wheelers can really appreciate what that feels like achievement yeah getting yeah. there yeah, yeah. definitely yeah. so we've driven a bear clock hill um at the Eaton springs which is known for being a pretty pretty decent technical hill. Yes. track um yeah just i lowered over the tires and just walked straight up it like this thing is is amazingly capable it wasn't hard because it was technical it was like a really challenging track i think it was just mentally as a driver would have been palm creek um just yeah, going yes. down something so steep and not having control of a vehicle and sort of just like letting go of your fear and just and just doing it. Yeah, just yeah. accepting. So, yeah. Just Palm Creek, it, it wasn't like a hard track to do, but I think just mentally challenging as a driver. Yeah. Was it easier than mentally forgetting to lock your hubs in? Uh, look, I was going to say the really hard track that I drove was the one where I cried on camera because, yeah, but I don't know its name and I really don't want to miss that. <laughs> it was the fire trail in the snow, to be specific. It was a fire trail. It wasn't even a track. Thanks for your time, man. We'll let you get back to your no worries, very busy stand. Yeah. It's always good to see Thanks you, man. Come and say no worries problems, at all. Problems, on problems, on problems, I solve them. I run through the money. The press will be calling. Left on my blessings. I feel like I'm falling. The birdie is back. Tell me I'm garbage, I'm going through something, that's why I ain't calling. Phone in progression, it's all that I wanted, a phone in affection, I summon and dub it. Why you be all in my line about nothing, why won't you go get you a dollar or something? Don't hang with a who line for nothing, I see that we different, you ride and I dub them. I don't do discussions, on bragging about hundreds, don't go to your places, I know that they sunken. Don't call me your brother, I barely could trust it. I talk to a shorty, she bagging the bugging. And I'ma need all of my dollars on corporate, so hand me the money, I divvy the pie. I'ma give all of my people a portion to build them a fortune, I'm flipping the ride. I can't be mixy when iffy the vibe, and 40 on 50 is really the time Why is you all on my phone like you want me Like you wasn't pushing the kid to the side I don't know if you thinking I'm blind Cross on my crosses and dot on my eyes Done with your efforts, I'm dealing with pressures I know it's a lesson, that's what it'll be We've had a killer day here at the Brisbane 4x4 show. We've hung out with a whole bunch of friends, checked out all of our awesome vendors, the whole bunch of superior cars fitted out. Hope everyone else enjoyed the show. Make sure you jump down in the comments, let us know what your favourite part of the show was and what your favourite superior vehicle was. The birdie is back. Tell me I'm garbage. I'm going through something. That's why I ain't calling. Phone and progression. It's all that I wanted. The phone and affection. I summon and dub it. Cause check out problems on problems on problems on problems on problems on problems. I solve them. I run through the money. The pressure be calling. Left on my blessings. I feel like I'm falling. The 